hello guys welcome back to my channel so today I'm gonna do nail art with a blue color but it's gonna be two blue color one is darker and the other one is lighter as you can see and I'm gonna drop one of that that's a mistake <laughs> So I'm just thinking to do blue on blue but I still have no idea what design that I'm gonna make just I'm gonna just uh, follow the flow <laughs> let it just happen because sometimes the idea is come and go whatever they want so I'm gonna just start it with a light blue After finish with applying two coat of the lighter blue, I'm gonna use this uh, snack lid. I think it's springless. Use it as my palette, <laughs> and I'm gonna use this brush. This brush actually not a nail art brush. This is. As you can see, it's very rough. This one is uh, for art and painting brush, but I cut it and I use it as my detailing brush, and it's it works really well. And I use it for a long, long time. <laughs> And you can see how dirty is the brush. Sorry. So I'm gonna do a random design with this darker blue. And I I'm still don't know what kind of design that gonna be, but just do it randomly. Maybe I'm gonna do abstract or something.
so then I'm gonna choose a water decal that I'm gonna use and as you can see there's a lot of decal but I think I'm gonna use this one okay I'm gonna just use this one on my nail
Bling bling time is my favorite time because I love bling and I love to put a lot of bling on my nail because it's fun and it's shiny and all of that so I'm gonna choose a big stone and I'm gonna uh, put one finger that have a lot of stone like a cluster stone and I'm gonna use this poly gel to attach a bigger stone and I'm gonna use rhinestone gel for the smaller one and I'm sorry I'm gonna let you all to see my head because I'm still a newbie in YouTube so yeah I'm gonna record my head a lot <laughs> because sometimes I cannot see because I have uh, I record this with my phone and when you record and do nail art it's sometimes it's I just can can see my nail <laughs> So I'm gonna pick this stone just to give it color and this is my rhinestone gel and you can see there's not, not much more on the jar because I use it so much and this rhinestone gel is quite nice and it have a strong hold on my rhinestone but if you want to attach a bigger stone you better use like poly gel because it's much stronger
Okay, it's time for top coat. And after top coat old nail, I'm gonna show you the finished result. So this is the finished result as you can see it's simple and it's have enough blink not too much and yeah I like it so thank you guys for watching and I see you later bye